I'm here with Stuart of the band Mogwai, the purveyors of Glaswegian, what I like to call sonic violence. Would that be an appropriate statement to describe what Mogwai is all about? I don't, I don't know if it's always violent, but yeah. <laughs> It's an interesting take, definitely. Okay, it's maybe an ambient violence, because it's a bit nice. It's a bit a beautiful brutality. How about that? Yeah, that's all good. All right, you can have that. I'll give you that one. You can use that wherever you want. Well, we're here at Montreux Jazz Festival, which you're much familiar with. You've played here many times before. What does it mean to come back here and, and play and put your music on display for the fans here at Montreux? It's great, yeah. We've always enjoyed playing here. It's a beautiful place. It's <clears throat> yeah, the gigs have always been good. Happy yeah. to be back. Okay. What was the first time like that you came here? Did you have any perception of what Montreux Jazz Festival was like before you stepped foot here? Yeah, I had because it, it's been on the TV so much over the years and seen a lot of great performances and definitely knew it was a big deal. So yeah, it was it was exciting and it's great we've been asked back so many times. You have been in, in order for about 20, 21 years now and we've seen so many great bands come from Glasgow. I'm talking about like Orange Juice, Primal Scream, Jesus and Mary Chain. What is it? What are you guys drinking? What are you eating? What is it about Glasgow that just has such a prominence for creating bands with such a unique sound? I think it just rains a lot so everyone... Yeah. <laughs> Everyone just stays inside and <laughs> makes makes music. Okay. So they're forced to make music because there's nothing to do outside there. There's nothing to do. All right. It's so maybe it literally is in the water, but it's in the water that's falling from the sky. There. I think there's something in there, yeah. <laughs> so having played here before many times over, can you give any advice to people who are playing Montro for the first time? Like, what can they look forward to? How should they prepare themselves to play here at Montro Jazz Festival? I guess practice a lot because there's a lot of really good musicians here, yeah. more than at most normal shows. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to pose this question to you. What does it mean for Mogwai to be here and celebrate for the 50th anniversary? I think it's amazing. It's amazing to be invited back. We've played here a few times and just seeing the history of the, the caliber of people that have played here. It's not like your normal rock festival. You're talking about a lot of real genuine music legends. And yeah, it's even to be in some small way connected to that is pretty special.